I'm here with Bree Pettis. How are you doing, Bree? Hey, Mark. Good to see you. <laughs> Great We're to here, see Ted. So, yes, it's, uh, yesterday you gave a uh, demonstration of the new Replicator 3D printer from MakerBot, and you showed a really cool old-school clock that uses a catchment mechanism. Um, and you kind of told the story of how that how that happened. Could you could you talk about a little bit about that? So, I brought a project to TED, which is a clock. And I didn't make the clock myself. The community made a clock. And it started with one guy uploading an escapement, and the next thing you know, we've got a gear train. We're getting together for a clockathon, or and then it all works out. And then other people start making different variations of the clock. We live in this world now, where there's lots of makerbots in the world and we can share things on Thingiverse. And that makes so many interesting things possible. So many interesting things can happen now because sharing things, just like sharing music or sharing books or sharing movies, gets, it just changes the way that we think about things. And we normally think about things as consumers, like I need something, where do I go shopping for it? But now you can think about things as I need something I'll just design it, or hold on, let me check. Maybe somebody else has made it on Thingiverse, and sure enough, I can download it and customize it and have it. And if you are a designer, you should share your designs, and what you get back is every, everybody else is sharing the designs. We're creating a library of things that we can all have for free. Very cool. Thanks a lot, Free. Good to see you.